top. You know, we were hearing about water rescues all day long, and we can't say it enough. Turn around, don't drown. Not everybody did that today. There were several rescues in Frederick County, Maryland, and in some cases, drivers were even parked and the water caught up to them anyway. That's what happened to a school bus with students on board. Tom Dempsey is live with more on those frightening moments. And Tom, this is the closest we've seen you to that school bus, and the water has really receded at this point. Yeah, that's right, Leslie. Uh, water has actually receded several feet over the past few hours here in Thurmont, which means we can get right up close to this school bus that was a subject of this water rescue earlier today. Two things I want to show our flashlight so they can get a better idea. Look at all this debris on the front of the bus. You can see this that go up about three feet up off the ground, which again tells you how high up this flood water was earlier today. And again, just how dangerous this situation was. We're going to walk back here. You can actually see one of the back wheels of this bus completely off the ground. I can put my hand underneath it again, showing just how dangerous this situation was. In total, 10 students had to be rescued off this bus earlier today, including uh, the bus driver as well. You can imagine how scary this was for parents earlier today today. Uh, we spoke to the school district, though, and they're actually commending the bus driver uh, for the way they acted in all of this. Again, uh, we know the bus driver was driving along this road. There were no road closures at the time, and the uh, driver saw flash flooding happening in the distance. They were not driving through the water, but they called dispatch upon seeing it. And then again, just how crazy I know quickly something like this can change. The flash flooding led to the dangerous situation and quickly led to that water rescue needing to happen. But again, the uh, the school district sent out a statement a short while ago apologizing to parents for causing all this stress and anxiety earlier today, guys. Uh, but again, the most important note of all this with this bus uh, almost on its side, you can see right here, all 10 students were able to get off safely and the bus driver were able to get off safely. We do know Frederick County Public Schools will be in a two hour delay tomorrow morning due to these bad weather conditions. Guys, you know, I'm so glad to hear that everybody is OK. And again, the message for everybody, turn around, don't drown.